Hello ladies and gentlemen, we come to you guys with some breaking news from the Tory party conference and the Home Secretary Suella Braverman's speech, which was absolutely brilliant and we are going to do a video reaction to her speech later on, but uh, right now we're talking about something that happened during the speech that not many people actually noticed, uh, but uh, Andrew Boff, the London Assembly member, Tory London Assembly member, uh, protested. Well, he was basically not happy about some of the stuff that Suella was saying because he's on the liberal side of the party. Uh, and But in this video, we're going to show you the clip, but also the reaction, the, the crazy reaction from the mainstream media. First, let's go to Suella's speech. You don't challenge this poison. Things just get worse. There's no such thing as gender ideology. All institutions become captured. No. And no, of course, this is, this is as always happens when the left gets the upper hand, those who fail to Chased out of their jobs for saying that a man can't be a woman. Scolded for rejecting that they're beneficiaries of institutions. So that was hardly a protest. That's that's <laughs> So firstly, Andrew Boff, who's the uh, London Assembly member, uh, for those who don't know, uh, he's on the Liberal side of the Tory party, and uh, he was just sitting there, um, and just like, being a grumpy old Liberal, just being saying, oh, uh, Suella was, just mentioned the, the gender ideology, and he said, well, there is no such thing as a gender ideology, right? So he wasn't happy about that, he was just having a Liberal meltdown. But he was quiet about it, and he was just making grumpy comments. Um, obviously, the, the security are very on top of everything uh, this year because they don't want any sort of proper left-wing protests infiltrating the venue. The funny thing is the Liberals who are in the Tory party, they infiltrated the Tory party decades ago. But, <laughs> but jokes aside, the reaction we had from the corporate media has been absolutely hilarious. This is Paul McNamara who is opposed, <laughs> supposedly the senior political correspondent for Channel 4 News. So your job as a senior political correspondent to know the obvious faces. Andrew Boff ran to become a London mayor. So he ran for the London mayor election. His face is recognisable. But he said, uh, Paul said, Heckler at Suella Brabman's speech has just been kicked out. Hashtag CPC 2023. He makes Andrew Boff sound like some sort of random uh, left-wing protester who only went to the speech to heckle. Um, no, he, he sits at all the speeches. I've, I've been doing, I, well, it's the first conference I haven't been in a while. Second conference I haven't been. But I have been to Tory party conferences before. He's always at all the speeches. He sits there, watches them, and obviously, Swella Bradman is more conservative than Andrew Boff, so he's going to moan and whine like an old liberal. But Paul McNamara is not the only one. Emily Maitlis, oh dear, Emily Maitlis is a pro, she's supposed to be having a lot of experience, she literally was filming on her phone, she saw Andrew, Andrew Boff was right in front of her face, and she said, audience member, oh audience member, just escorted from the main hall by the police during Suella's speech, very quiet if protesting, we couldn't hear his message clearly, we couldn't hear him his message clearly, what <laughs> What is it? Some sort of Karl Marx protesting in the middle of the, the Trafalgar Square. His message. What was his message? Ladies and gentlemen, we must find out. The, the, the <laughs> so the funny thing about this is that, one, Emily Maitlis should know Andrew Boff, who is a senior assembly member um, for the Tory party, who stood in uh, for the London mayoral election, obviously failed in the primary. But not only that, they make the whole thing sound like so stupid. So... Obviously, there's, there's, at this point, there's a lot of liberals in the Tory party, a lot of liberals. As we would say in the last video, I mentioned, overall, the grassroots of the Tory party are more conservative-leaning. But those who have more senior roles, including some MPs and some assembly members like Andrew Boff, they are very, very liberal. They're not on the side of Suella Bradman. That's why he decided to moan and complain about uh, Suala Bradman saying, mentioning the gender ideology. But I'm just fascinated by how senior mainstream media journalists and reporters have no idea what they're talking about. <laughs> and they are getting a lot of money to do that. And I'm sitting here telling you guys that we have to fact check the fact checkers. I will continue to do that every day. Thank you so much for all the support. I'm Maya Tusi, and we are the media.